Hello everybody and welcome back to yet another Anthem video. Now in today's video I'm here to talk about Easter eggs in Anthem. But before I start I'd like to ask you all to go and follow me on Twitter at x underscore joycey underscore x. I do post on there daily and I talk about mad shit all the time so just make sure you go and follow me on there and updates of videos will be on there also. I will link that down in the description for you guys. Now I'm not going to lie to you guys, I did get this video idea from the IGN 8 minute gameplay video that was released yesterday I believe and where he ra very like, vaguely spoke about the easter eggs in Anthem and I just thought I'd like to go into a little bit more depth for you guys. Now if you don't know what an easter egg is and you have been living under a rock then an easter egg is basically a little secret in the game that can unlock maybe something special or can give you an, ach an achievement or something something that is hidden from the players that are playing the game to find and work out, kind of like a little puzzle. But in Anthem it has been confirmed that easter eggs will be in the game, but my question is what will they unlock? Will they give you special gear or will they give you just an achievement on Xbox or a trophy on PS4, whatever you're playing, or does it unlock another mission that you have to complete to progress or what? I mean, if anybody knows, then please do comment below on, on you know, what happens, because I'm really curious. Now, I would show you the IGN video, but I don't want to get strikes for it, and it is also alpha gameplay, so I'm not sure whether I'm allowed to upload it, so I will not do that right now. Um, if I can upload it in the future, then I will sure do so. But in the gameplay, he, the geezer that is talking on the video says that he completed a public event and a secret door opened where him and, him and his friend went in there and there was a boss fight. Now, I do not know what exactly they obtained from this boss fight, but I can tell you that it looked awesome. They did also elaborate on other easter eggs that they found in the Anthem free play. They said, chests hidden in difficult positions to access, slain javelins that yielded crafting materials, harvested resource nodes and code eccentries that tell you a little bit about the area and the easter egg you have just completed. Now I think that it is awesome that when you slay other javelins you get their yielded crafting materials because they come so handy when you are crafting them badass weapons to get the roles that you are looking for. If you don't know what I am talking about I will link my recent video in the description where I talk about crafting, crafting materials and roles on weapons. With the harvesting resource nodes I'm not too sure what resources there are in Anthem. To be honest with you, I, I never played the uh, the alpha, so God knows. If you do know, then please do comment down below. And it is also pretty cool that there are code extentories in the game that, yet again, they tell you a little bit about the area and the easter egg you have just completed. So it's it tells a story. They did do this a little bit in Destiny when you found, um, say, a computer in the tower. It did tell you a little, the ghost did speak to you a little bit about how it became, how it got there and what happened and just a little backstory on the Easter egg. Now, if you did enjoy this video, please do go and smash that like button. And if you haven't and are new around here, then please do go and subscribe. I would much appreciate it. And once again, if you know anything that I don't, then please do comment down below. And until next time, people, peace. Oh, like, like, like this Netflix execution. This is what the people said they wanted from